love so soft to the touch they do have a couple of spooky things the girls didn't do their job on that one because it is so good right now i'm heading to coach to pick up a bag for my mama So this is the bag that my mom really wanted. So I'm gonna grab this for her. Hi, how are you? Yeah, so two things. I want to make a return, but I also want to make a purchase. So this bag, please, I would like. Yeah, so this is a charm. I had just purchased mm -hmm. the... Is this the big one? Yeah. <laughs> I have it in store and I've been dying to... Oh. So I have an essay at, uh, on the Fifth Ave store yeah. who I order things oh. from. And so you've been dying. Really? Well, now you have this one. This is insane. Oh my God. Okay, let me go grab that back for you. Look at this. They are so excited to get this. That's charm in store it was just too heavy on my bag i couldn't well that is she loves collecting charms yeah like displaying but them. It's, it's like the new york especially yeah uh, new york yeah it's so that cute so cute. so so cute you how, I got it. You how heavy that is all right let me go grab the bag thank you so much <laughs> Now there was another tabby bag that I was really interested in. It's the same tabby bag, but in maple. That beautiful, really rich brown color. Um, it looks like they don't have it in the store. I honestly don't need to buy it anyway. So again, I'm gonna process this return and get my mama this bag. She's gonna wrap it up real nice, but let me just see what else they have around here. I feel like these are the bags that everyone is obsessing over right now. And they're really cute. I've seen them before and I totally get the hype because like, they're just so nice. I love, so soft to the touch. Not as soft as my carry-all in my opinion. Actually, it might be a little softer because it's a little thinner. You get a load of these charms. Oh, so cute. I actually have this one here, this tabby charm. I love it so much. Oh, they are having a field day with the charms. Can I tell you? They're like taking photos of it. So funny. Kind of loving some of these sunglasses. I just don't wear a lot of red. These are kind of cute. But again, I just don't wear a lot of red. So I feel like I'm just not going to get a ton of wear out of them, you know? So no one told me that they had a lighter version of this. That is so interesting. And how much is this one? 195 I believe. $195? Oh my goodness. I cannot. I love this. It's just that, you know, it's, it's heavy enough as is. I know, so I it's like, like adding a charm to the carry -all. I managed to get one of these in Merlot. I'm so excited. I managed to get one of these in Merlot. But, oh, sorry. There you go. Thank you. <laughs> it doesn't make the bag like super heavy. I know. It's just, yeah. This is the 40, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah. It's already pretty heavy. <laughs> But I love it. I think it's a great bag. That going on over here. These chains, these ones are nice. Yeah, so and I'm really like, interested in the chains. So I think they're so pretty as well on the bag. Yeah, with these um, chains too, since the link is so big, you're able to put like other keychains like oh. on these and have it like dangle. Oh, they really thought this through. Mm -hmm. I love that. Kind of like a charm bracelet type of situation. Yeah, and this one's new as well. It features like three different chains that are layered. Okay. This one's really cute. Can I see the chains that the types of all oh, the chains that you have? Mm. We have there should be a lower like that all over like the Yeah. This one we have a plain one. Okay. We have like these ones as well. Oh, like okay. Leather. But I feel like these would look better on the carryalls, yeah? Yeah. These ones are cute as well. They're a bit long. They're supposed to be like cross oh, So you have I to like play around with them I where see. it's like a bit more like a layer. Yeah. 
Yeah. And like wrap it around like the handles and everything. Okay. Thank you. Though. You need anything? Do you have the you have? the tabbies and maple by any chance? The maple color is this one. I know that they have a style that's similar to not maybe not this big, oh, but oh, the maple and yeah. the yeah one. We do. We don't have it in store. Um, okay. I have to ask if it comes only in one size, um, but we can see if we can order it for you. Okay, no worries. We don't have to worry about that today. I'm just gonna get the bag for my mom, but that, that's yeah, fine. Yeah, we did have it. Um, I'm sure it went so maple. fast, didn't it? Yeah. <laughs> it's okay. I don't know how many we got. I think we only got like one, like to see how it works. Um, but yeah, that one was perfect. It looked really stunning. I'm sure I know. <laughs> yeah, I'll just wait and press my luck. You kind of go from there. Plastic, or do you want to take everything off? Of it? Can we take everything yeah. off of it? Okay. Thank you so much. Was there anything else you wanted to no, on it's just the back, back please. Well, you're and I have the um, e receipt okay, yeah, as yeah. well. Bag pickup is complete. Mom's birthday on lock. It's crazy. My parents were born the same year, just three weeks away from each other. So my father's birthday is this week. We're having a big party for him on Saturday, and then my mom's birthday is mid-October, just a couple weeks later. So crazy. Both having very big milestone birthdays this year. But anyways, we're about to walk into Bloomingdale's. I'm about to go and sniff some of the good things that they have here. Now, unlike Sephora, I'm actually hoping they have the things that I want here in store. I really want to smell Palatine by Parfums de Marly, but let's see what they have here. So they actually do have some coach bags here, but not the um, maple color that I really want. I think that color is gone, y'all, to be thoroughly honest. I'm also definitely going to be checking out the shoes at some point because they do have a pretty good shoe selection, especially on the sale rack, clearance rack. So let's see what they have. Hi. Heading over to the fragrance section. Let's hope they don't try to upsell me on something, child, because I really don't need to be buying anything. Oh my gosh. Came in, gone. A lot of people that took it. Two, two grooms today, and yesterday two brides. Spray a little bit more on there, just a little bit, so I can get the full. Oh man, I like that a lot. I can see, I can see that as a wedding scent mm -hmm. for sure. That is lovely, and I love this bottle. So I, I like to call her Periwinkle because it reminds me of you ever seen Tinkerbell? Yeah, with the periwinkle oh, with yeah, the white? yeah, that's beautiful. And then this is the 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 brown Valentino. We're just oh, yeah, smell it. Oh, 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 oh. it's worth ordering or okay. waiting for it. Okay, because I just went to Sephora actually and it was gone. They had yeah, like a little stand. Fine. Fine. We had like eight of them. Oh, that's so nice. Eight? What you gonna do with eight? No, we had eight of them. They all sold out. I know, but that's what I'm saying. They only gave you eight? That's when it's in, well, this one? What's well, limited edition, yeah? yeah? Is, is the Donna limited edition? Is that... So interesting. So they it's uh, 156 would be 136. Oh my gosh, that's lovely. It's very. I mean, I feel like all Hermes scents are very yeah, Mediterranean. They're, they're very yeah. You know, in nature, mm -hmm. it's lovely. Oh my goodness. It's different. They're so different. That's they cool. are. I have a couple. I have. Um, I have this one and this one. The okay. Twillies are both really nice. Beautiful, yeah. And I think I have one of these. This I can't be, remember. These are the original. This, shape. this one, the blue one, I'll show you. But now, what is, notes are in this one? Try that. It has, um... Okay. Uh, I Let me double check. You're okay. She, she, she's... Yeah, I work for her, so she wouldn't... Um, Kat? What's the note in the original one? I can't take a picture. Oh, my gosh. 
That's what I want. This one is two forty. Okay. And the other one is what? Very clean, very fresh. Mm -hmm. A little bit of vanilla too. Okay, I sense that. Some creamy. We're gonna talk about yeah. That. It's beautiful. It dries different though. It dries. I think it dries better. I think it, it comes alive when you have it. Okay. Oh my gosh. Uh, uh, uh. Okay. Am I gonna like it? Is it good? Be honest. It's good. No. Okay. Thank you so much. Anytime. Of course. Thank you. Thank you so much. Thank you. So I just wrapped up in Bloomingdale's. I did end up picking up something. It wasn't one of like the newer things. Granted, it, it kind of was new. It was Valaya by Parfums de Marley. I did smell Palatine, but I wasn't in love with it. Not that I wasn't in love with it. Let me take that back. It smelled really good, but it's just not something that I see myself or foresee myself wearing. A lot so it didn't just it just didn't make sense for me to spend that amount of money for me to barely wear it but Valaya the girls didn't do their job on that one because it is so good so now I'm just kind of walking around a little bit to see if I want to pick something else up or just window shop a little bit more I do not have Tiffany money right now so I am not going to Tiffany and Co not to mention the bracelets that I purchased from Tiffany and Co. I want to say about a year ago now. I barely wear them. I also tried the new Apom from my son Francis Cujon. I really liked it when I put it on my skin. It's creamy. It has some vanilla, but it's not strictly a vanilla fragrance. But I put it on my skin and it kind of went a little mature on me. And the sales associate even agreed. So I unfortunately left that at the store. Sorry, I'm looking at Ferragamo right now and there's this bag that is so beautiful and buttery. I'm gonna show it to you. Look at this bag. Look at how beautiful and buttery it looks. Oh, it's amazing. But can we also talk about the amazing customer service that I was able to receive at Bloomingdale's? I know there's this whole conversation that's happening right now about associates and cashiers at stores not really saying hello or speaking nowadays but let me tell you these middle-aged women and men who are working at these department stores at these fragrance counters oh baby the customer service is impeccable now a big part of me wants to walk into Louis Vuitton but I know good and well I am not about to get anything from Louis Vuitton but I just haven't been inside in a while and I come want to see what they got not that I need to be spending any money, and I feel like if I went in there, I'd definitely be spending some money. But And the great thing about this mall is they're going to open up a David Yerman. And if you know me, you know I love a good David Yerman bracelet. Hello, hello, hello. But look, look at this. Building a new little David Yerman. Not little, this thing looks big. Where I am about to go right now is Pottery Barn. The last time I went there was when we were decorating my home. We got some bar stools for my kitchen island. So I just wanna see like the fall stuff that they kinda of have, see what they are talking about. I know there's gonna be lots of pumpkins, but let's just take a look. They do have a couple of spooky things, but my family's so saved and holy. If they seen ghosts up in my house, chill. I'm always just such a huge fan of their decor. Just so nice. Always been a fan of these big lantern stand thingies. They even have ones that are in the shape of a pumpkin. But I know my cats, please, please. They would have a friggin' field day with some of this stuff. Honestly and truly. Well, I'm not seeing a ton that I'm really liking here. They used to have so many trinkets around the holidays. I don't really know what happened, but it is what it is. 
Yeah, y'all, I've been at this for a little bit, so I'm going to head home. My girlfriend Natalia is going to come over later. We're just going to kiki and kick it.